Oh, we're actually see. Oh, right. Aver has a repertoire of B characters as he well. He does. So, are we gonna see the gunner to start things off? No. Oh no. Min Min, just going straight to Min Min. I think he's just checking the sets. Yeah. So on to this one. Big Boss getting things started with a couple of down tilts, but Aimer spots the opening. Ooh, Aimer! Looking for one of those absolutely punishing Min Min uh, sequences here, but Big Boss firing right back. We just see these two go coast to coast. Long time to get up enough invulnerability to avoid that down air, but Big Boss still pushing himself in. Yeah, when you get to play at this level, timing and knowing what your resources are is invaluable. Good Excellent lead. grab here at Big Boss. He's pushing the issue. And actually, DI by Aimer survive. Yeah, it's so easy to get crossed up by that DI there, but Aimer, a veteran, has a couple of rubs in region, knows that. Oh my gosh, he actually got popped up. He might have DI'd up out of that, but Big Boss maybe for the follow up and gets the bait shot up smash. Enough time to recollect the gyro as well, but. Gonna eat a megawatt to put him on the left side. Nice. Aimer has Big Boss having to go down low to retreat. Wow, bad trade for Big Boss. Still able to find his landing. Aimer was ready for that laser. <laughs> oh, not gonna get the stock there. It's a little unfortunate for Aimer, but good job by Big Boss to survive. Pressing the issue. Making Aimer have to struggle and work for that kill. A couple more projectiles. That dash attack is going to cross up, and Big Boss couldn't cover the space. I mean, it's just hard for Rob to cover everything around him. The character can be so unidirectional. The character's best get off me move is a down smash for the most part, so that's part of the part of the issue. Or Nair. Right, Nair. And then Nair. Oh, wow. Aimer's able to swipe away the gyro. It's still floating out there. Like recycling. <laughs> Back throw should do it. It will. The big suplex. Oh, I thought Aimer was going to go for the kill right off that, that straight hit. Yeah, that landing there, traditionally a combo starter, but just not in a position to take advantage was Aimer. Wow. Big Boss is threatening so much space with those fares. Ooh. Ooh. Big Boss? Oh, man. He had one heck of a string going, but he's still putting the boots to Aimer, and then I'll smash to do it. Yeah, if Aimer couldn't match out at 145, there was nothing he could do at 160. Nice parry by Aimer, and the up smash as well. We're not, we're not seeing Aimer use the up smash to re, re, uh, reflect anything, but Jesus, haymaker after haymaker from Big Boss right there. Yeah, sour down or a sweet spot would have ended it. Yeah, so much of Rob's kitchen ended like that side B, like a scythe. Nice delay on that up special though to avoid the ram ram as well. Oh! That back air is gonna trade for Big Boss. <laughs> That move killed, even though it didn't even look like it came out. <laughs> <laughs> Rob's busted, baby. Rob's busted. I think a lot of people have been saying that from the start. Big Boss, I, again, you can, you said, uh, you highlighted a couple reasons why this matchup is so perilous for yeah. Min And the fact that he is able to get in, he can approach from high, those landing nares, a viable combo starter, can get strings going on its own and so safe as well. Uh, move slowness on an aerial doesn't matter when you're descending from above. The safety is more important. Yeah. And it looks like Aimer is opting for a change of pace. We're going to see his uh, highly vaunted Me Donor come out. So, with Me Donor, there is this common misconception that the Mees are only there to basically slow down pace of play and throw a projectile wall. But I find you'll see that. Uh oh, we need to get a oh, chance no. to get out of first gear. Big boss, the big denial. And that's Rob in a nutshell, baby. Yeah, 10 seconds gone, one stock gone for Aimer. Yeah, Aimer ha Aimer's quartering himself to try and regroup. And that is part of me to understand gameplay. I mean, we have to be very honest here. The character wants to dominate from a corner and mid-range. When the character can strap, it's just hard to strap against a character like Rob that can do darn near everything in this game. Yeah, Aimer, unlike uh, SoCal's other prominent me gunner, MM Leo, does use that first neutral special, the charge shot equivalent. Yeah. That's the thing, Big Boss might not necessarily have as much me gunner experience explicitly, but definitely has Samus experience. Oh my gosh, my man said, I'm gonna give you this one more time. 
And the spinning side B is gonna do it. Yeah, if you do use your jump like that and you're that far away, only have one route to recover, Rob's slide oh. special will eat you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Jaro does so much, man. <laughs> and big boss right now, very much in control of this game. It's just getting so out of hand for Aimer, who's just struggling to even get moving. Like I said, playing big boss is like being thrown into a cyclone. Second arm runner. This one is going to get punished. Had enough time to walk up before the up smash, too, and elicits a taunt from Aimer. Aimer's trying to pump himself up and try to get back into this one. The big boss is controlling the skies, these nares, and controlling everywhere. And as soon as it gets one, he's so good at just capitalizing off of it. So again, that back air is going to be safe on shield for what oh, Big Boss is Big Boss has steep there for a second. Aimer's starting to force the issue a little bit. Wow, look at that. He used the back air to ward away Aimer from going to the skies and then immediately zone out from below. Finally, Aimer able to connect with the charge shot. The gyro just expiring at ledge. Did fade back at the right time, but wasn't prepared to turn around. Aimer has to play so mistake-free right now because almost anything he can connect into is doom. Trying to pick up the gyro as well does, but again, forced to dash it to do it. And by the way, he gave up so much ledge space for that one interaction. Gets tripped up by the gyro again as well. But there we go, nice response to Big Boss trying to land on his shield for free. Tries to read a jump twice, but Big Boss not oh, getting Big Boss, up. he's closing up the space right now, too. Woo! Aimer has kind of, kind of lucky stars, he didn't get hit by that F smash. Manages to grab gyro and take a handle of Big Boss and throw him to the skies. Oh my gosh, Gyro right in the grill. Back throw from Aimer. The big boss from out deep still able to make Aimer not be able to hold tight at ledge. Good parry, but great fade back from big boss to avoid any potential follow-up. Aimer is just taking an inch right now, trying to go a full mile with it. Same big boss to the sky, trying to put big boss on his last stock right now. Oh crap. no, big boss found his spot. Finally gonna just clean up and uh, take care of Aimer right there. Yeah, that looked every bit as clean, if not even more than the Min Min game. Big Boss did a great job of adapting to an even different character, even with...